Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you Jesus. Thank you Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. My dear sisters and brothers in Christ Jesus. I'm very happy to welcome you to this Thunder of God episodes. May the spirit of the Lord Jesus Christ speak to you. Praise the Lord. Praise, Praise the, the Lord. Lord. In his second letter to the Corinthians chapter 3 verse 17 St Paul said The Lord is the spirit and where the spirit of the Lord is there is freedom. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Now let us ask our heavenly father to give us his spirit and let us thank the heavenly father for giving us his spirit already he has given his spirit into our hearts let us thank the lord for this hallelujah hallelujah, hallelujah. together with the psalmist let us give him glory and honor praise you jesus thank you lord we glorify you lord thank you lord praise you lord thank you lord hallelujah 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 Lord we worship you Jesus I will enter his gates with thanksgiving in my heart I will enter his courts with praise Thank you Lord I will say this is the day that the Lord has made I will rejoice for he has made me glad Clap your hands and sing together He has made me glad oh he has made me glad I will rejoice for he has made me glad I will enter his gates with thanksgiving in my heart I will enter his courts with praise I will say this is the day that the Lord has made I will rejoice for he has made me glad Hallelujah He has made me glad oh he has made me glad I will rejoice for he has made me glad Glory glory He has made me glad oh he has made me glad I will rejoice for he has made me glad. Hallelujah. I will enter his gates with thanksgiving in my heart. I will enter his courts with praise. I will say this is the day that the Lord has made. I will rejoice for he has made me glad. Oh, he has made me glad. Oh, he has made me glad. I will rejoice for he has made me glad. made me glad oh he has made me glad i will rejoice for he has made me glad I will rejoice for he has made me glad. Yes, he has made me glad. Oh, he has made me glad. I will rejoice for he has made me glad. He has made me glad. Oh, he has made me glad. I will rejoice for he has made me glad. Hallelujah. 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 Mother Mary, help of Christians, we offer our family lives in your immaculate heart and we pray. Hail Mary, full, full of, of grace, grace. The, the Lord, Lord is with thee. thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, women and, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy, Holy Mary, Mary, Mother of God, God pray, pray for us sinners, sinners now, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as, as it was, was in the beginning, beginning is now, and, and ever shall, shall be, world without end. end. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank, Thank you, Jesus. Jesus. So, my dear sisters and brothers, when the people of God hearing the word of jo- word of the Lord Jesus, the Spirit of the Lord really intervenes in their lives. So, I would like to. read a testimony of a couple so they are from cumbria in the united kingdom we are biju and sobi we were childless for 9 years medical science could not help us 
we gave up all medications and put our trust in the lord we had an opportunity to attend the catholic bible convention in nottingham arena led by father saver gan batail in the year 2012 and we prayed wholeheartedly for the gift of a baby and we promised our testimony if our heart's desire is granted during the adoration of the blessed sacrament father announced that jesus is touching few childless couples though it was a very busy day on his way out father saver gan blessed us and said be courageous and trust in the lord and he will fulfill your wish within few months so we conceived and we were blessed with our little angel and maria to glorify jesus name and testify his wonderful deed in our family and so be is caring for the second time now hallelujah hallelujah thank you jesus thank, thank you jesus so my dear sisters and brothers when you hear the word of god and when you worship the lord the lord will really intervene in your life praise the lord praise, praise the lord. lord hallelujah hallelujah thank you jesus thank, thank you jesus. jesus today i would like to speak to you about more children more anointing say beautiful thing some of you may be may be experiencing the gift of children especially some of you have 3 4 5 6 9 maybe children it's a great blessing in the book of genesis chapter 1 verse 28 the lord god blessed adam and eve and he gave them a very powerful anointing so let us hear the word of god now god blessed them and god said to them be fruitful and multiply and fill the earth and subdue it and have dominion over the fish of the sea and over the birds of the air and over every living thing that moves upon the earth so the bible says increase and multiply and subdue the earth so some theologians say that this is the first commandment of our lord increase multiply and subdue the earth and the lord has called our christian couples to keep this commandment and we have experienced in the lives of many saints that they have fulfilled this commandment for example the parents of saint therese of lisieux zelin and louis martin so this couple though they were very weak in their uh, health health condition they tried to keep the commandment of the lord and they gave birth to nine children and theres was the last one she became a saint and her parents they really led a very beautiful life for the lord praise the lord praise, praise the lord. lord hallelujah hallelujah i was reading the beautiful beautiful story of saint dominic and his mom's name is joan of aza and his dad's name is felix they had four children and four of them grew up they endured into their own life situations then this couple they prayed to the lord and one day while joan of aza went to a beautiful chapel and praying to saint michael she got a vision that the lord is giving her another child and who will become the torch he will become the light in the church and she thought oh lord i am now elderly how it will be possible but she surrendered her life to the lord and the lord anointed her with another child that is dominic he became a very powerful saint in especially in the middle age while the church was going through lots of difficulties the lord 
used him as a torch he became very powerful instrument as you know mother mary gave him the rosary and he really renewed the church praise the lord praise, praise the, lord. the lord hallelujah hallelujah so the parents of many saints were really they were saints they took the pain and another example is saint catherine of siena her mom gave birth to 25 children can you imagine 25 children many of them died but the lord really anointed catherine in a very special way she was the 23rd of uh, of uh, her family praise the lord praise, praise the lord. lord hallelujah hallelujah thank you jesus thank, thank you jesus. jesus praise you jesus praise, praise you jesus. jesus i remember and a beautiful instance while father savior watile was conducting a bible convention in manchester back in the uk a family came and the lady was pregnant she said father this is my fourth baby and i have continuous bleeding i lost two babies i i want a special deliverance prayer and we prayed over her and immediately bleeding stopped and she gave birth to the child and again she became conceived and they are doing the work of the lord in a very powerful way very powerful evangelist in the uk praise the lord praise, praise the, the lord. lord my dear sisters and brothers the lord can bless you in a very miraculous way once you try to obey his commandment the lord said increase and multiply and subdue the earth now i would like to call to your attention to the book of jeremiah chapter 29 verse 6 where jeremiah speaks about the beauty of more children if in a very powerful manner the lord is speaking through prophet jeremiah please listen take wives and have sons and daughters take wives for your sons and give your daughters in marriage that they may bear sons and daughters multiply there and do not decrease you see the lord god is insisting his people to multiply the lord is asking do not decrease do not decrease in your number praise the lord praise, praise the lord. lord hallelujah hallelujah thank you jesus thank, thank you jesus. jesus and some 127 verse 3 sons are indeed a heritage from the lord the fruit of the womb a reward so the bible says sons and daughters are really gift from god and the lord really wants to give his gifts to the couples but many people they don't receive that gift so my dear sister and my dear brother when you are hearing the word of god now just examine yourself how is your family life do you receive the gift the lord has offered you the lord wants to anoint your family the lord wants to bless not only your family the entire world but whether you received the gifts with an open heart please examine if you have committed errors ask pardon to the lord the lord will forgive you and the lord will give you more children in the uk there is a family and they before coming to know the love of the lord jesus they used this birth controls and contraception and they stopped uh, giving birth to children then what happened when they heard the word of god they got a inspiration to go back and do one more surgery and the lady did it and the lord again blessed them with another 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 baby so if you have denied or rejected the word of the lord regarding this giving birth to more children ask the lord pardon the lord will forgive your sins the lord can give you more children please please open your family life to the lord John Paul II says in his beautiful encyclical Humanae Vitae every sexual contact should be open to life 
so the couples should should hear that every sexual conduct should be open to life praise the lord praise, praise the, the lord. lord hallelujah hallelujah in psalm 127 verse 4 and 5 verse 4 says like arrows in the hand of a warrior are the sons of one's youth so if you get more children what happen they become like arrows so in a very positive sense we can say they they'll become very strong strong in their faith i have visited a few families who have the more children so i have seen that children they are spiritually very powerful very powerful they look after their younger ones there is a sharing and caring in the family they pray together and the relationship with the husband and wife they become very smooth they love each other tenderly all this happen by because this couple they try to observe the commandments of the lord praise the lord praise, praise the, the lord. lord hallelujah hallelujah again verse 5 the bible says happy is the man who has his cure full of them he shall not be put to shame when he speaks with his enemies in the gate it means the lord will fight for them the lord will be protecting them and he will not become ashamed that means the family who open their marital life to the lord and trying to keep his commandments will be protected by the lord in a very special way praise the lord praise, praise the, the lord. lord but in our community we see that many couples really face lots of problems once they are open to life what happens their neighbors mock at them even some of their relatives laugh at them but my dear sister and brother if you obey the commandment of the lord the lord will himself fight for you exodus chapter 14 verse 14 i myself will fight for you you have to be still praise the lord praise, praise the, the lord. lord hallelujah hallelujah thank you jesus thank, thank you jesus. jesus praise you jesus praise, praise you jesus. jesus now let us pray to the holy spirit please close your eyes the lord is touching many of you now open your families to the lord the vatican council teaches us about responsible parenthood the church fathers teach us that sit with the lord and think and take decision there may be lots of difficulties but our lord jesus christ will help you Lord Jesus I pray for all the families who are watching this episode Lord I ask you to pour out your precious blood upon them and wash them wash their family life cleanse them Lord give them your spirit a spirit of freedom Jesus I know into them oh Lord empower them oh Lord Hallelujah Jesus praise you Lord Hallelujah. for couples you pray to the holy spirit now that may the holy spirit touch you may the holy spirit anoint you may the holy spirit inspire you may the holy spirit strengthen your family life may the holy spirit open your family life oh holy spirit holy spirit holy spirit touch them anoint them hallelujah heal their wounds oh holy spirit if they are sick heal them lord heal them lord more children more anointing lord lord jesus give them strong faith lord hallelujah sing together spirit of the living lord holy spirit
if possible join your hands and recite the lord's prayer together offering your families to the heart of jesus and say together our father who art in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil amen may almighty god bless you the father and the son and the holy spirit amen and sisters in Christ Jesus now we are in the presence of the blessed sacrament he is here he is touching us psalm 62 verse 2 the bible says he alone is my rock my salvation my fortress and i will never be shaken now let us raise our hearts and hands towards him and give him glory and honor hallelujah 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 thank you jesus praise you jesus thank you jesus this is the power of christ in me jesus from life's cry to the final breath jesus commands my destiny No power of hell no scheme of man can ever pluck me from his hand till he returns and calls me home here in the power of Christ I stand thank you Jesus thank you lord praise you Jesus thank you lord praise you jesus thank you jesus you are the fortress you are our refuge praise you lord thank you jesus thank you jesus thank you jesus thank you jesus hallelujah hallelujah thank you jesus thank you jesus first john chapter 4 verse 4 the one who is inside me is greater than the one who is outside the world now we receive his blessing once again let us surrender our entire life to him and let us be aware of his presence lord jesus fill us with your presence now let us receive his blessing thank you jesus praise you jesus hallelujah lord thank you lord most holy oh sacrament divine all praise and all thanks giving be every moment thine oh sacrament most holy sacrament divine all praise and all thanks 
thanksgiving be every moment thine. O sacrament most holy, O sacrament dear.